let's yeah, have a right. quick overview of what's yeah, going we, on. We, we haven't For example, Vladimir, what is uh, he doing, yeah. Vladimir Kramnik? Kr Atabayev uh -huh. versus Kramnik. So finally, something strange happened that uh, White took on C6 and played D3. Uh -huh. This is ah, a bit yeah. unusual. Against Berlin, yeah, you don't play for a draw like that. Yeah, so it's a bit strange. Some and play D3 here. D3 here. It's a bit strange. Usually you play D3 first. And only when black plays bishop c5, so then you take you c6. Take after bishop uh, c5. Sorry, bishop c5. Yeah. You, then you take, take. And yeah. then... Yeah, the bishop is not so well placed on c5. Actually, in some lines, be, uh, bishop still goes back to d6, yeah. right? And here, after takes and d3, black simply played bishop d6 in one go. Yeah. So it shouldn't be, shouldn't be any dangerous for black. This is probably a good uh, line. Maybe I can go yeah. move by move. Vladimir continued to develop his pieces in a very simple way, straight forward, going for a long castle. He's, of course, trying to get opposite uh, castles, so he may fight for a play for a wing. But immediately White decided it's safer to go for a symmetrical, and he went also for a short castle, king. Okay, it's quite nice, no? How king, king, Yusuf Atabayev is uh, copying the moves of Vladimir Kramnik, but okay, here not rook h e1, but g4. G4 getting yeah. Some, yeah, he's getting some space on the king side. So knight is relocated from C3, which it, uh, mm -hmm. it has no prospect. It's quite nice the maneuver. Look at this, huh? Here, yeah, both knights. knights are on C3 on F6, and a few moves later they are on E3 and E6, both yeah, sides. Right. Because uh, well, knight F5, queen mm -hmm. F8, and then black. One day has black. Nice, mm -hmm. nice squares for knight, right? Uh, on F4 yeah. or maybe even C. 6 c5 is going to be mm -hmm. played and then knight d4. And knight d4 yeah in general it looks like uh, position should be pretty equal but maybe black has better prospects in the future but i'm not so sure huh? in fact the position is uh, quite balanced maybe the problem for white is okay let's say quite i don't know which move but knight f4 is a is a threat a because bit of a problem you mean yeah, after bishop f4, pawn takes, and then the knight on f5. But he can any moment take on d6. I mean, in yeah, fact, he right. could take immediately. He can take immediately. I'm thinking probably Kramnik's going to take with the queen in this case. Not undoubling the pawns, but trying mm -hmm. to get, I mean, uh, semi-open file. Mm -hmm. And then c6, c5, possibly b7, b6. You yeah. Know, to play it slow and to try to keep... Special mm -hmm. advantage. Uh, and yes. what about Magnus Carlsen? This was another interesting uh, opening with uh, E3. Yeah. But mm, we already said with Peter, so uh -huh. it's a. Uh, mm, yeah, let me. One second. Uh -huh. No. Foreign, but I have to. Yeah. Uh, now I'm bringing it. Should be this. No. Uh -huh. Yeah, finally. So it's here. There. Here yeah, we are. It, it, yeah, mm -hmm. it developed into something normal. It started with e3, but uh, as I said, here to be original, you have to start playing second-rate moves because if you play d4 or c4, it's something normal. In fact, they got this position, which is mm -hmm. well-known position from Nimtso, right? Yeah. Knight e4, castles, and then there is one funny line. Uh, well, it it was played. Bishop takes. Pawn takes now. If knight c3, yeah, I mean mm -hmm. that's a I know funny line, theory, yeah. right? Queen c2, black captures on f3, gf3, check on g5, and queen h5. Yeah, and, oh. and here is the position of Vladimir Kramnik. I was going to say strategically uh, it's something that the knight on f5 is extremely strong, and it looks that white is doing very well there. But if you look at the position a bit closer it's easy to understand that black is much better. Why? Because the knight on e6 is easily protecting the pawn on g7, so uh, white's action there is uh, easily neutralized. And on the other hand, black is ready to open the game on the queen side, where he has an open line, the d line, and a majority of pawns and two bishops. So the prospects for black are brilliant in this yeah. position. And actually, even though Kramnik played Berlin, but he's got the position he's got is unbalanced enough, I would say. Yeah, and uh, it's easy to see that Black can still improve his position, for example, by means of rook d7, then double rooks on the d line, and then at yeah, one point c4 some break on c4. Yeah, I think he's gonna win without. 
too much uh, difficulty. Today, of course, it's going to be a long game, but uh, he will be comfortable playing according to his nature. Yeah, you're right. This is his opponent. Player so from Kramnik is better, we said. Nepomnes is winning. Karyakin, mm -hmm. uh, well, Karyakin is almost winning. That's the position. It was a very yeah. open game in a French defense. Finally, so he's black took on a three and white took everything on the king side. Yeah, so that's what mm. happened. Uh, that's what we've seen. And bishop takes h6. We were trying to catch the queen here, but Karyakin simply took on h6. Rook we did, g8. Yeah, yeah, he wanted to play bishop g7 sometimes, I guess. Yeah, g3, and then this, bishop h7 here, and bishop went back to f4. Yeah, in this way, the rook is not allowed to take part. But most importantly, uh, white is preparing the way for his own rook to go to h8 after the bishop moves away. And uh, the problem for black is that the rook on a8 is out of game. I mean, and it's not easy to bring that rook. Yeah, into imagine the play. black is allowed to make two moves in a row, bishop d7 and castle long, and then it's then it's okay. It's unclear. You're right, but. Yeah, but how to do this? There are some rules. There yeah. are some you can maybe look for Chow. Yeah, but okay, okay just first you want to see Kramnik. Okay, what sure. happens in Kramnik's of game. Of course. And now I'm, I'm pretty much sure he's... Ah, look at that. He's a lot better. So it seems like uh, White didn't know what to do. At yeah. some point, I mean, White played so many moves with his knights. So knight went to c1, and then precisely as you said, black has Slowly. all the... All the possibilities to improve his position to the maximum. So that's precisely what Black did. Okay, this, this move, knight h4. Okay, please. Yeah, please. Move. What is this move? Knight h4. From f5, yeah. But f uh, what for? I mean, uh, what yeah, is this? Knight h4. Okay, you are working hard. You are doing a lot of work, a lot of effort to bring your knight to f5. And then you... Drive it away. Okay. Without he any. Okay. He wants to put the knight on g6, but the knight on g6. He puts it on g6. And he wants to break on f4. It's uh, it's clear. But okay, this cannot be true. I mean. Knight c5. Queen e2, and already it feels like something's going to happen here. Yeah. B4 maybe and b3. b4 b3. Very very nasty move because b now yeah. whenever something opens you going to be left with this knight on g6, which once again has yeah. no moves. And the bishop is coming to a6. Right. And no, if no. he takes d takes e4, then black can play rook d2. Rook d2 is and very then, annoying. Uh, e4, e4 is, is going to fall, and C4 this is going hanging. to be the end no, of that's the world. Rook d2 is probably just winning. This is a killer, yeah. yeah. Got Bishop queen, e4, and. Uh, I don't know. Queen e1, it, the queen e c4 is there, first yeah, of all. Mate. Yeah, it's made. Okay, a strategical uh, lesson today by Vladimir Kramnik. He played uh, very well, and uh, most probably he may win his game. We okay. don't know, we were not told. If Magnus Carlsen is going to give a press conference, probably not, because we can see he's hanging around. You know, there is a rule that when a player finishes his game, he has to he has to quit the playing hall. But we see Magnus is still there. Yeah, yesterday I saw uh, a bit of football match, uh, uh -huh. Argentina versus Uruguay, and Messi was complaining to the arbiter. I don't know if it's me, I get three red cards. Right. Messi did get nothing. Okay, so, so you mean <laughs> on his only Bishuk is um, yeah. Uh, That's the won. final position of yeah. Kramnik. Atabayev versus Kramnik. So no, this is a, po a poem. A poem of a uh, wrong strategy. I mean, White was playing on the king side and he allowed complete blockade there. Then Black got free hands on the queen side. And, and this Kramnik is what happened. Yeah. Yeah, you know, Kramnik makes the same as I do now when I play a young player. I make a strategical lesson. The only difference is that he wins the game, I lose my game. So <laughs> I am the perfect teacher, you know. <laughs> so okay, okay, but uh, he did well today, Vladimir, with his strange choice. We got uh, this question from Twitter. Yes, that, uh, so Grishuk,